See, what can you buy if you have a 20 rupee note? Well, we can buy number one, a toy car, a lemon juice, a banana, number two, a ball, a doll, a notebook, number three, a toy giraffe, a glass of milk, a notebook, number four, one toy car, one pack of biscuit, one toffee, number five, one banana, one glass of milk, one toy car. D. Do you need to make a cash memo for the things you bought? Monu prepared following cash memos. Check the cash memos and correct them if you find a mistake. Well, the corrected cash memos are as shown. Add the following. A. Rupees 12, 50 pesa plus rupees 13. Now 0 plus 0 is 0. 5 plus 0 is 5. 2 plus 3 is 5. 1 plus 1 is 2. So the answer is rupees 25, 50 pesa. B. Rupees 55, 50 pesa. Plus rupees 14. Again, 0 plus 0 is 0. 5 plus 0 is 5. 5 plus 4 is 9. 5 plus 1 is 6. So the answer is rupees 69, 50 pesa. C. Rupees 30 plus rupees 31, 50 pesa. Well, if you see the PASA column, 0 plus 0 is 0, 0 plus 5 is 5. In the rupees column, 0 plus 1 is 1, 3 plus 3, you write, is 6. So the answer is rupees 61, 50 PESA. Subtract the following. A. Rupees 25, 50 PESA minus rupees 11, 50 pesa. Now, 0 minus 0 is 0. 5 minus 5 is 0. If you see the rupees column, 5 minus 1 is 4. 2 minus 1 is 1. So the answer is rupees 14. Now the B part. Rupees 103 and 50 pesa minus rupees 62. Now 0 minus 0 is 0, 5 minus 0 is 5. In the rupees column, 3 minus 2 is 1. Now we have to subtract 6 from 10. So it is 4. Well the answer is rupees 41 and 50 pesa. C. Rupees 19 and 50 pesa minus rupees 7. 0 minus 0 is 0. 5 minus 0 is 5. Now 9 minus 7 is 2 and we'll bring down 1. So the answer is rupees 12 and 50 pesa. E. You have 30 rupees with you. Find out how much money will be left after buying the following items. A. One ball, one doll and one toy giraffe. Total cost dash money left dash. Now cost of one ball is rupees 7. Cost of one doll is rupees 8. Cost of one toy giraffe is rupees 6 and 50 pesa. Now after adding them, we get rupees 21 and 50 pesa. Kids, you know right that money left is total money minus money spent. So it would be rupees 30 minus rupees 21 and 50 pesa. Well, let's do it. Here we can borrow 1 rupee from 30 rupees and subtract 50 pesa from it. What is the answer? Yes, 50 pesa remains. So further we subtract 21 from 29 and we get 8. So the total cost is rupees 21 and 50 pesa 
and money left is rupees eight and fifty paisa. B. Two bananas, one pack of biscuits, and two glasses of lemon juice. Let's find the total cost and money left. Cost of two bananas would be rupee one and fifty paisa into two. That is rupees three. Cost of one packet of biscuit is four rupees fifty paisa. Cost of two glasses of lemon juice is rupees three into two. That is rupees six. Now the total cost is rupees three plus four rupees fifty paisa plus rupees six. That is thirteen rupees fifty paisa. Well, money left would be total money minus money spent. So rupees thirty minus thirteen rupees fifty paisa. That is sixteen rupees fifty paisa. Hence, total cost is thirteen rupees fifty paisa. Money left is sixteen rupees fifty paisa. Well, let's see the C part. Three notebooks, two pencils, and two erasers. Let's find the total cost and money left. Well, cost of three notebooks is five into three. That is rupees fifteen. Cost of two pencils would be two rupees fifty paisa into two. That is rupees five. And cost of two erasers would be rupee one into two. That is two rupees. Well, the total cost would be rupees fifteen plus rupees five plus rupees two. Rupees twenty two. Now the money left is total money minus money spent. So rupees thirty minus rupees twenty two is rupees eight. Hence total cost is rupees twenty two and money left is rupees eight.